Welcome, Senator John McCain. Welcome, uh, Senator McCain. Hello, my friend. All right. It's great to have you on the show. Yeah, whoop de frickin' do. <laughs> Obama's out picking his cabinet, and I'm up here at one o'clock in the morning talking to a seven foot skeleton. Uh. <laughs> my friends. Okay, oh, my friends. Okay, well, you, uh, Senator McCain, you sound really bitter. Bitter? Why would I be bitter? Just because America cornholed me at the polls, my friends? All right, Senator, just, just take it easy. Thanks, Mr. War Hero, Mr. P.O.W., but we like the pretty boy with the pretty John F. Kennedy suit and the regular-sized prostate. <laughs> Thanks, Senator McCain, but we like Obama because, ooh, he can lift a basketball. And, and Obama can bite into an apple, and he's on the internet, and he's on my face, my friends. Wait, it's, it's actually, it's, it's called my space. Go straight to hell. Okay. <laughs> Senator McCain, a lot of people, a lot of people said you weren't up to speed when it came to the internet. That's bull crap, my friends. I tried to raise money on the internet. I gave that Nigerian prince all my account <laughs> information. Where's my $20 million, Prince Mugatu Abakakaliki? Well, <laughs> my friends? Well, I... Senator, it feels like since the election, you're really not holding back anymore with the anger. Who gives a pigeon's taint? <laughs> I lost, my friends. I lost. Because I'm not Obama, look at me. I'm Obama, oh, I'm Superman. I can choose when I sleep and pee. <laughs> That's not good. Oh, hooray! Okay. I can control it. Well, you've got a lot to get off your chest, sir. Is there anything you can point to that you feel cost you the election? I One... can point to four things, my friends. Sarah, Todd, Bristol, and Levi. Oh, so that, that you think the Palins? No, the... the Jeffersons, you pasty, freckled foreskin. <laughs> of course I'm talking about the Palins, my friend. <laughs> those, those Settle down, iceberg... sir. Settle down. <laughs> we saw your script for a second, sir. <laughs> my friends. Yeah. Yes. Okay, I'm talking about the Palins. Yes. Those iceberg hillbillies grease gunned my ass, but oh, good. Oh, come on. <laughs> Sir, ice, <clears throat> iceberg hillbilly seems a little harsh. Oh, look at you. Now the media is suddenly standing up for those elk jockeys. <laughs> you liberal media whores have been hammering away at those moose-molesting moose pack of tundra trash since day one. <laughs> Why stop now, oh, my on. friends? No, come on. Why stop now? <clears throat> sir, sir, just try and relax, sir. I'm fine, my friends. I'm just glad the election's over, and it's the last time I ever have to see those Aurora Borealis. holes. Okay, come on. <laughs> come on. That's right, my no. friends. In all fairness, you picked her, sir. You picked her. Tell me about it, my friends. Biggest decision of my life, and I go with hoes before bros. Oh, come on. I guess I was thinking with my little maverick, oh, my friend. No, come on. You shouldn't say little maverick. <laughs> sir, you yes. can't put all the blame on Sarah Palin for your loss. Obviously, a lot of people say President Bush hurt you. Oh, he didn't hurt me, my friends. He went to town on me like a bouncer on Andy Dick. <laughs> That's, well, that's right. That's pretty bad, yeah. That is very bad. Yeah, that's a Conan, keeper. <laughs> when that panhandle paste eater came into power, he had a balanced budget and a country at peace. After eight years, what he left behind is what I leave behind after three bowls of crackling oat brain. Oh, my God. <laughs> Sir, you do not have to go there. I can't go there. I can't at all until I have three bowls of crackling oat brain. Senator my John, friend. that's nice. I gotta get out of here. We'll take a break and we'll come back. Ricky Gervais. Ricky Gervais. Yes. Yes.